Welcome back, everybody. Today we're playing Phasmophobia, and we're going to be doing the weekly challenge. So today we have Survival of the Fittest. You've got no pills, no sanity, and no evidence to work with. It's going to be a tough one. This is on 42 Edgefield Drive, or Road. Uh, so yeah, this is basically uh, no evidence, but with no sanity. So this is going to be a little tough. We're going to have to use our knowledge here. We're not always going to get the ghosts right, I don't think. I don't. Uh, we could get lucky and get ones that just vary on speed. I think it's unlikely, though. So we're going to just want to get in there with the smudge stick. Uh, oh, we get pretty crap stuff, don't we? A weird assortment of stuff here. So we get a, a tier 2 flashlight, 1 spirit box, 3 EMF, 2 camera, something sir, 1 crucifix, uh, tier 1 smudge stick and salt, tier 2 parabolic, uh, 1 or 2 motion sensor, tier, I think that's one of the, uh, head cam, tier two lighter, one candle, and three of the sanity stick, or sanity pill. So, that's pretty interesting, too, because these, uh, sanity pills, while they won't do anything for us, they will make us faster, I'm sh pretty sure. So, Jaro's out here with zero percent sanity. Uh, well, obviously, we're not gonna care about those extra things. We could, we could get hunted literally as soon as we walk in here, so... I think we're gonna first just run upstairs to see if there's anywhere we can hide. Okay, there is. Alright, so... Uh... I mean... <clears throat> really, we could just let it hunt. I thought I heard it do something up here. Oh shit. It's hunting from our hiding spot. That's not awesome. And we uh, threw our flashlight instead of kept it to use. It's normal speed. It leaves off these ghosts here happens to be like pathing towards us too. <laughs> this is gonna be a tough one. It's gonna be very tough. Oops, it's uh outside light. Alright, so did I leave my flashlight on? Okay, I didn't, so... Oh, I left the CMF on, though, so it's not a ride, you. We could, we could hear it. Not being speedy. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna throw these here, and I'm just gonna go get the rest of the smudge sticks. These are gonna be nice to have in the house, because we're gonna have to uh, do something with all of these ghosts. Now, let's, let's see here. <clears throat> Spirits. We'll test with smudge stick. Wraith. We'll test with salt. Phantom. We'll check with camera. Uh, or by seeing it, of course. Poltergeist, we'll have to loop it around the couch with items on it. Banshee, uh, we'll have to do stuff. Okay, there's a lot of things we can do here, so... Um, anything that's a super easy rule out? Mm, not necessarily. A uh, Mimic, I guess. Let's get these inside. I'm just gonna throw them here for now. And then let's also get... Oh, we don't get a video camera. Oh, that's really tough for Mimic. They may, they're gonna make us actually check a mimic the way it's intended to be checked. Um, let's get one of these in here, and then some salt. Careful, careful. It came from here, right? If that's the case, it's got the crucifix. If we get the crucifix, then we can have a little bit of extra time um, to prepare. But we can also use this as a de as a demon check. And put this, like, here instead. Let's do that. We didn't have enough time to set up anything. Hmm. <clears throat> yokai test, yokai test, yokai, yokai, yokai. Yokai, yokai. Yokai, 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 yokai. <clears throat> the 
might be a yokai, but it also might not be getting close enough. We'll test that another time. Alright, so the first thing we need to do is go ahead and get some stuff on here. It's also probably not a demon, by the way. Because we can kind of predict where it hunted from there. This is like the worst lighting ever. Um, so let's just move some stuff. We're going to check Polter here. We can check Jin here also. We can check for Phantom here. And we can check Oni, if we're careful. Shit, where's my smudge stick? Am I holding it? I'm not holding it. We need to go. <laughs> I dropped my smudge stick. And I don't remember where I put it. <clears throat> yokai, 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 yokai! It might just be a yokai. I mean, I don't know if I'm close enough. <clears throat> Yokai! 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 Okay, it's not a yokai. That time it hurt us and tried to open our, our door. Okay, so. Where did we throw our shit? Did we just throw it here? I don't think we did. This is so unhelpful. Uh, okay, here's some stuff. I don't know if that's the, this is the room it's hunting from, though, which is a problem. So let's put this in here this time. And also put this in here. It may have been the room next door. Oops. Okay, it did something in here, but it also... <laughs> oh, my camera's downstairs. Okay, we need to run through this in case it hunts. Hey! Get away! Okay, stop forever. Forever, don't ever do that. That was terrifying. Okay. Um... My flashlight. I don't really need that right now. Um, what do I hear? Where do I hear a sink? Oh, it's the one over here, isn't it? Why isn't it hunting? Is that a twins? Why would that be on? Start from back there. You hear that EMF? What if it's a polter? <clears throat> Somehow the EMF picked up on something. I the camera, I could have gotten a picture, but it's fine. Did it kick something over here? How did we get EMF? Did you hear that? Closet touch? Very suspicious that it's done several things in that room without stepping in that cell. But it's also not always hunting from that room. Which makes me wonder, twins, do we have uh, this? We, we have the spike that can often mean it's EMF. It doesn't mean it is. Uh, but it can mean that it's EMF as the evidence. Hmm. Where to put this? I forgot to throw on this light. Uh, this probably isn't smart. We need our flashlight. Mm -hmm. 
Maybe we should save the salt for next time it, like, walks towards us. Like, as, a, as an event. That might be a better way to try to get salt. Because it's kind of seeming like it might be, uh... It's seeming like we might be getting a, a wraith. Okay, I'm gonna set the salt up here real quick. Ah, damn it! Wait, follow me in here. That's fine. Uh, this. The camera was there, but I don't think I was fast enough anyway. Alright, there. Shit. Where is it? Alright, whatever. We can test for a couple ghosts here. Okay, not a poltergeist. Oh, Jesus, don't follow me, you piece of shit. I might be dead. Okay, I'm good. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> okay, so that wasn't a gin. Oh, it's on me. Wasn't a gin, wasn't a poltergeist, wasn't a phantom. I didn't pay close enough attention to see if it was an oni. Onis are a little harder to identify. That was me. Me, not the mayor thing. Okay. So. Get one of these. I still have a smudge six more around here. Um. Take that and rule these out. I don't think it's a demon. Um, what did we say? We just said it wasn't something. A gin. This is gonna be rough. Oh, I've been counting. It's, a, it's, it's at 12 now. Let's just say I smudged a minute ago. So at 11. So at, at 12.30 on this thing, it can hunt again normally. That's just a gross estimate. Um, in the meantime... Okay, so I don't think it's a Twins, because it keeps hunting from the same spot with the same speed. It's not a Yokai from that test before, right? And I don't think it's a Myling, though it's really... This is the worst map they could have picked for Myling to test it. Um, just kind of clicking lights for fun. I don't want to leave the house because I want it to. Uh, I want to see when it hunts because of the smudge. Hmm. We should be fine now because it, it it should be able to hunt. So let me grab like this, this, and this. I don't know if this works downstairs. Go and get these back. Um, let's see. I don't know where it's hunting from. We need to find that out. It's not hunting from here. We've learned that. I think it might be hunting from back here. Fine. I'd say that's not a spirit. I'm gonna blow that out myself. These things go faster. They'll go down real fast. It's gonna be really hard to identify if it's a mimic. Which is how mimics should be, but we're gonna have to keep an eye out for that. We're basically gonna wanna hear it like just randomly be fast or slow. Um, I don't have my salt. <gasps> beep, beep. Okay, where are you hunting from? Please, can you give me a sign? Is it hunting from over here? Does anyone know? I just did something in here. Alright, let's do... Chill. And I guess I'll just hide because I don't know where else to go. I don't know what else to do. Um, so Banshee, we can try. Oh, let me hold this close. Banshee, we can try maybe with the motion sensor. We still need to get salt. 
I just need to figure out where it's hunting from. I can't figure that out. Okay, let me out. Fine. Okay. So that candle's probably wasted, by the way. Was it hunting from here? Now it's opening that door? Dude, I don't get it. I really don't. It must be down here. Yes, okay. God damn it. Finally, get some salt down in there. And then I can also uh, get a motion sensor. Oh, my item just switched itself. Get a motion sensor between it. I don't know, man. This is a little tough. Not spirit, by the way. Yuri's gonna be a pain in the ass. I think that's why they gave us tier 3 AMF, by the way. The, uh, the Oni. It is identifi identifiable with its ability with the tier 3 EMF. Hold on. Where did, uh... Okay, let's get this in there real quick. Did you try to not be a piece of shit? This is the empty one. Shit, man. <laughs> it's so fucked. This is the... It's done a lot of singing... I mean, a lot of events, but not a lot of singing events. So, uh... I feel like it's not gonna be a banshee. Alright, finally some salt down. And then let's go back down. And get this. Really? Just at a singing event, so it must have been just outside of the range. So Shade, we haven't really had a chance to test Shade. Um, Oni will have to get another look at it, I guess. Gorio's literally going to be impossible. Um, we'll have to knock out Obake and One together and just do our best with that. I'm really hoping we're just gonna get shade. Please just give me shade. I mean, not shade, wraith. Please do not give me shade. That would be the worst thing you could do. Okay, put that there. Any salt stepped in? Nope. Um, let's go get another one to put in front of the salt so we can hear if it stepped there. Tiny, look at me. Finally burned the crucifix. It gives us another like 20 seconds to work with. Probably a wraith, right? Oh, it's not an Oni. Look at that. Oh, maybe it's stuck. That's a ghost event, right? It's a mare. Actually being an asshole though. This ghost is so lame. The second I put some salt and emotion sensor down, it does three ghost events. One of them outside the room and two of them as ghost balls. Which all three of them basically don't mean it's not going to step in the salt. Like if it did one by me, 
and then just didn't hunt for a little bit, then it would have to walk back in its room and step in the salt, but it's, you know, zero sanity. So what are we going to do about that? <clears throat> okay, we don't have these anymore. Um, door touch. I want to see, I want to see this light up. Because I'm pretty sure we just have a wraith here. We have to, right? That's why we kept hearing it do things when it wasn't in its room. Maybe it was teleporting around. I don't know. Let's take one more stretch down. Don't be on the stairs, please. That one sounded like it hunted pretty close to me there. Wait, but I think I just heard it walk out of its room. Maybe into its room. Why would I hear three motion sensor sounds? That doesn't make sense. Unless it literally walked... But it started between them. Walked out, walked back in, and then walked out. Maybe. I think those are the only movements that could have it do three sounds. And then be it at downstairs. Uh, not sure, but let's get one more salt. Me out. I'm pretty sure it's not a Banshee. I'm gonna roll out Banshee. I'm not gonna test for it. Because I feel like that's just, uh, it's a little extra. Oh, this breaks all these lights down. No! Honestly? We just gotta see if it's in Obake, and if it's not, we're gonna have to just fucking guess, man. <laughs> Are you in Obake? Christ, man. I don't know. I honestly have no idea. Uh, we might just have the ball. Thing is, it could be an Unreal. It's the only thing I haven't given a full try. I put this in here once, in the room once, and it, it did an event. In this room. Chill. This is active, aren't you a little active guy? Okay. I don't know if it blew out. Well, it had to have blown out the other one. Okay, so now it should hunt. Maybe the other one didn't count. Or it's not an Unreal. Yeah, I figured. Dude, you're a very annoying ghost. Very active. Nothing here is particularly active. I just want to see it hunt with the candle lit. it got all the way empty. I'm not sure what to call this. 
I could have been wrong about the demon thing, because it it interacted with a couple things in that blue room. Okay, not done. I don't know if it's a mimic. I'm gonna just assume that it can switch rooms and that this one didn't because it's a Gorio. I think that's all I can do. Yeah, let's go with Gorio. It's going to be one of the infamous, uh, terrible ones to find out. Abake is not that bad to find out, but, um,. In this map it is. It's, the looping spot is really bad. So I don't know, let's find out. Let's see if it's Gorio. Completed 30 daily tasks. Did we get it right? We did get it right! Revenge! Like, like revenge. Screw you, Gorio. You guys don't remember the last video I put out was a, uh... Actually, at the time you're watching this, this might come first, but I put out a video um, about how I did 80 minutes, 80 minutes in, um, what's it called? The big campsite, Maple Lodge. 80 minutes with a Gorio. I had one evidence, it was insanity. And it didn't do a single dot. I, I checked so much, man. It was a very frustrating time. Alright. So it feels good to get a Gorio. If it doesn't switch rooms in an extended period of time, this might be Gorio. Alright, let's see where it hunts from. It's hunting. So we're gonna do our checks here. Another normal speed ghost. See if it's a gin. If it comes down, it might not come down. Which is fine. It's coming. <laughs> We would have lived too if I didn't get stuck on that extra table. Alright, it's okay. So we now we know it's not a djinn, we know it's not a phantom, and we know it's not uh djinn phantom. Well we know it's not any of these fast ghosts. Um and then what what else was I looking for? Why can't I remember? Can't remember. We'll think of it. Um yeah, let's get another one of these in there, and then now we need to start ruling stuff out. So, let's find out where it hunted. Actually, let's hold this and walk up there. See if we can get any information. Oh, I didn't check when I when I smudged, but that was probably about 2745 on this counter. Um Oh. Okay. <laughs> Fuck you, man. <laughs> the, the ghost balls are actually so annoying. <laughs> Did you hear that? Did we just get a Yuri ability? Run. We need to see if this shows up on the MF. I've never heard that in my life. Please. We're too late. I think that was your ability. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ, a woman. Okay. Alright, so we're... <laughs> I think right now, we're basically just in um, a mode of let's see if it's a mimic. Because I've never heard that before. There were like three doors that moved at once. I'm, I'm saying it's Yurei. Actually, I'm so curious because we never get Yureis. If we can just say it's a Yurei and get it right. The reward is way better than the risk here. If it is a Yurei and we identified it through its ability, that's amazing. Welcome back. Let's go! Okay! <laughs> Okay, 
That was the shortest like run ever. We we had a single hunt on zero sanity, zero evidence. Oh my god, that feels good. That feels good. Can we see uh uh abilities used? Zero. Excuse me. Wait, did we just get lucky there? Oh <laughs> what? <laughs> no, it's lying. This is obviously wrong. This has to be wrong. <laughs> There's no way. There's no way. Wait, this tells you the bone location. Why? Why does it? Where's the favorite room? I'm just curious. We need to start looking at this, by the way. Seventeen objects moved. Okay. Anyway, that was your hey. That's insane. Wait, we're the best Phasma players ever. Holy shit. All right, let's do this. Wow. The easiest one that we're going to have is a Yure. Can you believe that? Do you actually believe that? Uh, okay. In case it emotes first, we'll instantly rob right? It's important to instantly turn these on if you don't bring a flashlight. Kinda just needed to hunt. Not really anything we can do here. We don't know where it is. And it's not worth checking. I can put some stuff down. We don't know where the ghost is, so I'm not gonna drop an item. I'm not gonna drop my smudge for three items. I mean So I recently heard that, like, the shade won't hunt if you're in the room with it, but also it'll also do a check, like, every time the ghost is going to hunt, it'll check, is this a shade? Hold on. <clears throat> Normal speed again. these real quick. I'm lost. Okay. It's in the basement, so that's interesting. We can do stuff with this. I don't know if the basement is one big room. I can't remember. Um, oh, Poltergeist was the thing I was thinking of last time. And no, it didn't seem like Poltergeist this time. I recently, a wise man once told me, very recently, that if you think if you, if you if you're not sure if it's a poltergeist, then it's not a poltergeist. Okay. Now I'm gonna be honest with you. I haven't. I don't think I've experienced the mare ability yet. In all my time playing, like how it can instantly, it can turn off the light as soon as you turn it on. We don't need this. Uh, actually, we can bring this. Uh, let's bring this. We have one in there. Let's bring this. Uh, this is for like year eight tests. Um, what am I trying to say? The mayor can turn off the light as soon as you turn it on. Uh, I've never actually experienced it myself, I don't think. I'm not sure if I did. I'm not sure if that was it. Okay. Well, that time it wasn't the mayor ability because it burned a crucifix. Four, five, six. Not a wraith. Okay, it'll be able to hunt any moment now. Probably not a demon, since it's not hunting. So we'll go ahead and leave. I don't think it's a spirit. I didn't I didn't time it. Maybe we we'll we'll do another one to be safe whenever the time comes, but um I think it's not a spirit. 
Just to be a little more accurate, we'll do it again. Uh, we run out Phantom. I don't know if we can count sh Well, we were turning off the light, so we were in the room with it. <clears throat> Yokai and Myling and a Raiju. I think it's not a Myling. I actually, I can't tell. I can't tell. We'll have to do another test in that room. So just to be safe, we're going to want to do a couple tests at once so we don't burn through smudge sticks. So let's grab a... Is there anything better to grab? Uh, I think not really. We'll grab a flashlight, put it down for Raiju, Myling, Yokai. Um, we can do those three at once, and then we can also do another check and see if it's an Abake. So Abakes have to do its transform at least once during the hunt. It's rough, though. You can't... You can't guarantee it. Like, you can't guarantee you'll see it. That's what I mean. Oh, did it just turn off the breaker? I assume that means the breaker's down there, because I heard the click pretty clearly. We really don't want it to hunt without the breaker. Okay, yeah, the breaker's down there with it. Honestly, if it hunts down there, we probably can get... I just mind. Fast. Right, you. Slow now. There's no electronics up here. Okay. We'll just we'll check again to be safe. Just and also so you can hear it better. Um so you heard it being normal speed up upstairs. I don't know if you heard it being uh, normal speed downstairs or fast up downstairs. Dude, you've got to stop doing that. <laughs> hey, buddy. I'm going to make you step in salt. <laughs> Shit. Alright. So. Oh. Stop. Alright, listen. It's gonna hunt any second now. Listen to hear how fast it is downstairs. <clears throat> there is always the chance that that's not a Raiju thing and it's a mimic and it switched to a fast ghost. But it'll, we'll leave it off, it's fine. The ghost ball event is the most annoying event in the game, only because of how loud it is. It is so loud. It's not scary, it's just annoying. <laughs> you know how fast that is? You can hear it slow down at times, too. That's it getting away from the flashlight on the second floor, or first floor. Oh, we can't turn that on, though. Now, it could be a Mimic. We're not going to test for a Mimic. It did that twice. And it took a while to hunt. It wanted to do, like, five emotes on us first. So, I'm pretty sure we just got ourselves a Raijin. that. Two, uh, two things done, too. 1% sanity. Let's go. Can we take this? No. Oh, yeah. There we go. All right. Good challenge, actually. Let's look at statistics. We have to skip. And then we got our big, big bucks. So, seven minute, eight minute investigation. Pretty good. Um, objects used. What does objects used mean? Does that mean crucifix? It probably means crucifix. Um, 38 objects moved, okay. Ele it touched 11 doors. One, okay, so it did turn off that light. It did t turn off the fuse box. Um, sweet. 52 interactions. Ability to use zero, okay. I don't know if the Raiju has an ability, actually. I don't think it does. Five events, three hunts. Okay, cool. So that's the challenge. It's a pretty good challenge. 
survival of the fittest. Basically, just hard mode, zero evidence. Uh, it definitely is hard because you lose a lot of setup time that you need to identify certain things. You know, where you're trying to set up uh, parabolic and motion sensors for Banshee. You're setting up salt for the Wraith. You're setting up objects to throw for the Poltergeist. You have all these things you want to do, but the ghost is hunting every 25 seconds, and it's just... A real pain in the ass, but if you really know the ghosts and what they're able to do and what they're not able to do, then you can really nail down what the ghost is. So, for example, and as we learned in another video, uh, if you if you have a ghost that you've been looking at for a long time, you've you've ruled out almost everything, and it hasn't changed ghost rooms, you might as well just go with the Gorio, because uh, that just might be the case. I don't even know if ghosts can or can't change here, but. We don't know that, and we know Gorios can't change rooms, and we had like five ghosts that are impossible to check, so we just went with Gorio, and we were right. Second round, we heard uh, several doors touched at once. Only the Ure can do that without a ghost event, therefore it had to be a Ure. The stats page said it didn't use any abilities. I'm just going to assume that that was wrong, because if you go back and listen, it definitely sounds like multiple doors were touched, but I guess there is a chance that we had the 4% luck there. Uh, <laughs> and then the Raiju, obviously uh, you have it running at a normal speed in a hunt, and then the next speed it's super fast near electronics and slows down away from electronics, you might as well go ahead and say it's a Raiju. All of these situations, it's also possible for it to be a Mimic, and if you want to be as thorough as possible, you want to wait a little bit and see if it, it is consistent with these things that you're noticing. Um, uh, you should really just use a video camera for a Ghost Orbs if you have the possibility. In this challenge, you don't. So, um, But of course, it's a challenge, so you lose nothing by being wrong, and it's only a, like... 1 in 24 squared, somewhere around there, chance that it's actually a mimic of the ghost that you're looking at. So you might as well just not go with the mimic unless you want to be super thorough. Uh, but yeah, that's a good challenge. We like these harder challenges that require us to think a little bit. So I like that. I appreciate it. I appreciate that it wasn't just all tier 1 equipment as well as a big challenge because that's super annoying. So thank you for this challenge, Phasmophobia devs. And thank you all for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. And I will catch you all in the next video. Goodbye.